hey guys welcome back welcome back to my channel yes so today i'm going to be talking about because i had seen this on facebook and i was like so sad and i really felt sorry for this little guy because he uh, his mom was saying that he was getting bullied at school and you know she didn't know what else to do and he was on there talking about he wants to die and stuff and then i see this come across my uh, my news feed on Facebook this morning. <clears throat> so, um, it, it, let me see if I can pronounce his name. It says Quandon, um, Bailey's story may be a scam. I guess that's how you pronounce his name, but I know that I went to check it out for myself, and I went on his Instagram, and this kid has, like, 30 different accounts on Instagram. Like, why do you need that many accounts? Like, you ch you changing up or something, because maybe somebody may be seen through his life. But this kid got a lot of money. He wears designer clothes. <laughs> now, um... And he's been getting a lot of outpouring love and support. Even celebrities like Hugh Jackman have sent videos of love. As well as he's been offered free classes at an MMA um, business. And he's being offered trips to Disneyland. And he's got like a 300000 some dollars. Why do you need that much money to go to Disneyland? Like Disneyland don't cost that freaking much. So, here he is with his middle finger up. Um, so, somebody wrote here, this kid goes to my kid's school. He and his mother are well known throughout the school, not for good reasons. The kid has a bad attitude and constantly teases other kids, then cries when the kids give it back to him. Doesn't that sound like somebody we know on these YouTube streets, guys? <laughs> We not going to say that person's name, but this sounds just like somebody we know, huh? Now, it says, I don't condone bullying, but this kid incites it, then has the audacity to bitch about it. Don't believe the story. Um, it says, Chris Gray, uh, what is that, wrote the article, Leads of the Activist name here instead of just the mother's name and or mentioning that later in the article that she is also an activist then kind of makes me figure they are attention seekers i mean you got a lot of people on these streets that do this every day they scam they scam people and, and he's good because you know he's so small so he he can depict a nine-year-old, you know what I'm saying? He can do that. But the thing that I don't understand is if he's being so much bully at the school and nobody's doing anything about it, why wouldn't you expose the school? Like, if it was me, I'd tell the school's name. Why aren't we hearing about what the name of the school is? If he's being bullied there. It said, looks like our little actor has been playing our hearts all along. Seems to me that there may be more to the story. So right here you have him. He's on Star now. It said he's an uh, actor, extra, a model, and influencer. And you got him with loads of cash. I'm telling you, this little guy can dress. I'm not even going to lie. Like, his, his dress game is on point. <laughs> that little guy can dress. But, like, a lot of people are saying that um, the story is real. But now that people are um, having second doubts, people actually want their money back. And now that people are having second doubts about this, you guys are going to have to come up with a birth certificate. To show that this guy is really nine years old. Like, people just ain't gonna believe that you say, No, the story's true. He is nine. He is nine. Like, we gonna need birth certificates. We gonna need some receipts now. Because people are thinking that this is a scam. So, if he's nine, just bring out his birth certificate. You know, show people that he's really nine. 
and um expose the school let's talk to the school about this let's talk to the school to see what they have to say about him so-called being bullied but other than that like we not just gonna believe what people are telling us we don't do that over here. We want to see some receipts. If if you know me, I need to see receipts. Now, after seeing this, somebody better bring out some receipts somewhere. Or if you got some other proof that he's nine years old, then let people know. But yeah, you got you got a lot of these uh these little people. That's why I call I call them little people. And they be so small, but they be like 16, they be 20 years old. Y'all, you guys seen them stories. If you haven't seen that um show, it's called Born Different. They're all on there. Okay, so let me read some of uh, these comments. I don't buy this bullying story. I feel like the bullying thing was a thing just so he could get clout. Because somebody said he's already an Instagram star. Like, he, he, he knows celebrities and stuff. This is looking like free marketing. Um, I'm big on no bullying. But why is this kid flashing dollars like a rapper after such a horrifically bad bullying incident? Hmm. <clears throat> it said, this Instagram is so different than that video where he's crying. What What the hell, really? This kid is going to be a star when he, he he's older. It said, homie pulled off the biggest finesse of 2020. <laughs> Uh, where's Gucci and flexes thousands of dollars on his, uh, IG, but has been donated over a hundred and, and over $120,000 on GoFundMe. It's, it's higher now. I think it's, at, it, last time I checked, it was at $300,000. I wonder how many of those people know about his. IG. I mean, he had. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you guys how many um Instagram accounts this dude has. This kid has. People saying working. This kid barely know what the hell money is, let alone work. Laughing my a off. And it says that my mother is um exploiting this child. Unfollow and get your money back to those to donate it. Hold up. Unfollow and get your money back to those who donated for him to go to Disneyland. Shaking my head. What a sick ass team. I don't know if you're going to be getting your money back. That money probably already long, long gone. <laughs> All the blood desire to cook, honey. He probably went shopping with that money. It said, who would allow their nine-year-old to flash the bird, let alone post the pic of it? Oh, maybe a parent that uses the F word numerous times in front of him. Yeah, because she was cussing. It said, biggest finesse of the year goes to Midget from the UK. He is a 32-year-old actor that raised 300000 on GoFundMe. Special type of scamming. So now they're saying he, he 32. So right now, we need to see some receipts on how old this kid is. Because right now, we're we not believing this right now. Like... We're not believing anything. We don't want to hear from anybody that says this story is real. Show us a birth certificate so that we can know um, what his real age is. Because his real age could be anything. We already seen this. If you ever watch, um, remember the little people on the, they had that little Atlanta show. And they had, had all them uh, little people on there. And one was 23, and they were all small. Like, come on, man. It said, uh, just so you know, he scammed everybody. He's 18, has plenty of money, and yeah, everyone fell for it. 
Now, if I'm wrong, please, uh, what did it say? Source your link and explain why to me. He's a Instagram celebrity quad. What's that? Deuce? Deuce? Dog? The quad dogs? And deleted captions pertaining to his 18th birthday post. Yeah, somebody said this post right here that he actually, um, when he found out people was finding out, he, he edited, uh, the post. Because you know you can go in there and edit. And he put somebody like, mom, mom, something, you know, happy birthday <laughs> or something. But look, this, look, this dude is chill. Look at how he dressed. This guy got on Gucci. He had on some Jeezy shoes. You know what I'm saying? Somebody said, I mean, I didn't create the GoFundMe to begin with. It was made for them. Also, he is nine years old. Many nine-year-old be acting bad now. They laugh out loud. That badness is also created for so many reasons, but that doesn't mean that he's, his feelings are all of a sudden not violent. This still brought many people people awareness okay well if he's nine then you guys show us a birth certificate because now we people are saying he's 18 people are saying he's 32 and people are saying he's nine so if he's really nine bring out the birth certificate that's the only thing that's going to um let us know his real age or if he had if um he had some kind of driver's license or whatever but we're not just gonna believe you um, Jesse, just because you say that he's nine. Where's your proof? Where's your receipts that he's nine years old? Okay. He's 18. An adult should be. Yeah, he should be charged if he's scamming people out of money. Just like they locked that black guy up that scammed all them girls online. This is the same. This is the same thing. And if he's found out to uh, have lied and he hasn't, he um doesn't get charged, y'all should boycott the court system boycott it over there because it's not right you you lock up black people for doing this crap but you're not gonna lock up his little behind like come on somebody said susan edwards he is not 18 18 years old he is a nine-year-old school a nine-year-old boy <coughs> exclamation mark well uh pamela pamela let's see some receipts let's see his birth certificate because we're not just gonna believe you okay now people people's getting people are people are um we're real weary right now about this story and people want their money back so if you can prove that he's nine and all y'all people jasmine too if you can prove that he's nine Give us some kind of proof, because that's the only way we're going to believe you. We're not just going to believe you that he's nine. Now, this guy, Brian, he said he is not 18. Fab story. The laugh out loud, and it's on dumb looks, so it must be true. Dumb. Oh, dumb book. I need my dad on glasses. What's dumb book? It's a shame you don't do your research before posting such things. Here's a video from 2015 when he was four. So, yeah, he turns nine this year. Okay, so let's uh, check this out. Welcome to Living Black. I'm Carla Grant. 
reconstructive sleep apnea and otitis media, he's already had two operations to improve the quality of his life. Grommets were installed and then replaced to the use of his arms and legs. Slight Okay, but um, that's that's still not telling us anything that he was for. Look, we gonna need to see um, we're gonna need to see a birth certificate. I I don't want to see any more links to you guys' videos and stuff like that. It's stupid, you know. Um, we gonna need to see a birth certificate. Nobody's gonna sit down and watch no freaking video. Of anything, show us some. Show us his birth certificate, you know, and then we'll believe this. But other than that, nobody's gonna believe this crap. And um, I, I'm hoping that he is not, and I'm hoping that he didn't scam people. But if he did scam people, he needs to give him and his mom needs to give the money back because that's only fair. Somebody said, when I saw the video and he asked for a knife to kill himself, I knew then it was a scam job. But his white trash mammy. <laughs> oh, my Lord. There seems to be something sus. And sus is just suspect about that slang for suspect about this. Not sure what. And I don't condone bullying in any way, but something just ain't right. Yeah, it just didn't seem... Like, at first, he had me, for real. He had me. I was like, oh, my God. Like, how can... You know, they be doing this. But when she didn't say the school... The school that he was going to... And if so, if somebody lives in um in the UK where it is, where he goes to school... Let, let us know, like, go up in there and see what's going on and give us some information on was he really being bullied because, as you see, a person has already said that he he was, he was has an attitude. He was doing the bullying, and then when he bullies people, it's okay, but when they give it back to him, he can't take it. You know, some people just believe anything. You don't need to give them no proof. But uh, over here, we need proof. So, uh, what I'm about to do right now is I'm going to go to Instagram. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, do I still have it up? And now I'm going to have to put it in. Hopefully, it'll come up. Uh, hold on, y'all. So here's a couple, here's one, but the last time, that's one of his pages, but the last time, I forgot what I put in the last time, here's another one, and a whole bunch of pages came up, of just him. What is his name? Let me put his name in. See, there's some more pages. See all those pages? Those different pages? Th 
There it is. Look at all them accounts, you guys. <laughs> Look at all them accounts. Oh, my God. He got like a thousand some accounts. Look at that. That's crazy. Yeah, like he got <clears throat> mad accounts. I got a cold guys. But that's pretty much what I wanted to show you guys, all his accounts. And sometimes you can go in there like... I don't know who that is. But to me, it seems like he's living a plush life. You know, he's living a good life. Most of these are private. What is that? Is that a, a bone? That look like one of them things they smoke weed out of. Is he smoking weed? Oh, Lord. Y'all. <laughs> Let me tell y'all something. Look, look, look at this guy. Like, this guy, he, he living a good life. Look at that dog. You know how much them dogs cost? So, you know, right now, we're going to need to see some birth certificates right now. We don't want to see no links to any vid. We don't want to watch no stupid videos, okay? What is this? He probably trying to get that bad, them bad spirits away from him because he's scamming people. <laughs> like, get them away. Oh, my Lord. And this is that video. You know what? I'm not even going to play that video. Because it, it, it just make me mad. To know that he could be a scammer. But I'll play this one of him flashing that kid. We get some work in. We get some work in, see? Work every day. Yeah, like. My, money, bro. Yeah, like. See? Look, he flashing all that cash in y'all face like, thank you for the $300,000. Look at this. This guy is plus this guy wearing Gucci. <laughs> like, he is. <laughs> like, dude can dress. You know, a little guy can dress his behind on. He said, this is where you get from walking. This is where you get from walking. But, uh, I don't know. I feel bad for you. If this it, when they do come out with his birth certificate, because that's what they're going to need right now, because I'm not believing crap. I don't want to see no more videos or anything. But when they do come out with his uh, birth certificate, and they prove if if he's nine or whatever, or if he's if, if he's not nine, I know that um a lot of you people gonna want your money back, and I'm hoping that you do get your money back, cause if he has scammed people, it's wrong. You shouldn't be doing that to people. I mean, you got all this lavish and luxury stuff, but so why is is, is that how you got? To, to where you're at, you know, you scam people, 
Because I told you what you do in the dark comes to light. Look at all these accounts. Okay, guys, but uh, I'm about to get on up out of here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. If you haven't yet, please like and subscribe my channel and share with all your friends and loved ones. Hit that bell notification so you know each and every time I upload a new video. I love you guys. Always thinking about you. Until next time, please stay safe and stay warm. I love you guys. Bye-bye.